morning workout done. I'm in the gym, I'm getting changed. Ooh, can't go too long. I ain't got no pants on. <laughs> oh damn, my ball stinks. Yeah. So everybody want to know why I'm not fighting? Why I haven't fought yet? I'm about to. We gonna go press my coach together. We gonna go ask him why I'm not fighting. He gonna give you some bullshit. And, oh, you ain't ready yet. You you flim flam. You ain't in the gym. I work out every day. Meanwhile, this man is always on the road with all these other fighters, neglecting me. Let me put this down for y'all. See my dick. Hold on. So Dre, my, my followers, my followers want to know okay. when I'm fighting. We trying to get it together right now. Got to get that weight down and get them in shape and uh -huh. we'll rock and roll. All right, y'all heard it. Y'all heard it. You heard it. <laughs> but also put this ball. But he got to be in the gym too. I'm in the gym. He there now. Give me black Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Black Jesus is a is a is a weapon. It's a, it's a weapon. It's a it's a hard. It's a, it's listen. You just have to experience to know about it. <laughs> All right, bro. This this is Khalid. Khalid, bro. We should we, we should we share the same name. My Arab brother. <laughs> oh yeah yeah. This is my media man. Hello. This I is am. this is Stewie Griffin. <laughs> <laughs> that's black. That's black. Jesus, this thing hurts. It is no joke. It's just like harder than a baton. <laughs> what? <laughs> he said it's a big room of dildo. Yeah. You can just imagine women going. <laughs> yeah. He. And he. Listen. He from overseas. He different. It's all right though. He get a pass. year I decided to I, I decided that I wanted to change things and make myself like really busy and just and just really like you know and just accomplish a lot so if you want to accomplish a lot and you want to change you have to change yourself so I'm, I'm picking up a lot of good habits getting rid of the bad habits you know um, just not not playing games prioritizing things so that means putting certain things that matter first and you know a lot of people are, are used to how how one of my mentors would say a lot of people major and minor things meaning people worry about the wrong motherfucking shit so you know what I and know what I noticed a lot of people and a lot like I would say six or more people they get mad at me especially females and I'm not saying no fucking with mad females that's not what I'm saying they're friends but listen here mad females like some guys too but not not so much but they get upset because you don't answer their texts or calls and it's and they're like, oh, you will use on Instagram. Listen, I use Instagram as a tool uh, to promote me as a brand. So when I when I post certain things, it's for a reason. I post nothing by accident. Everything I do is very strategic and I might be giving myself up by saying this and it might be letting you into, uh, you know, a little into who I am. But listen, nothing's by accident so if and a lot of now recently as of like this year i don't really look at my text messages that much i don't um i don't really like get into it like i i'll see my text messages i'll leave 30 unread text messages right now i probably have like 20 but i'll do something first that needs to be done so then you'll have some people who call themselves trying to be petty or get back at me because they think that i'm doing this purposely but no i'm really like making myself busy i'm really trying to work hard towards a goal like i just told you like five times in this motherfucking episode that i want a house so what does having a house require that means you need to be a little more responsible that means your credit has to be up to par that means you have to have a certain amount of income that means you have to have a certain amount of money coming in every single month that to, for you to get approved for a loan uh, you got to qualify for a lot of things and not just that. And that's not my only fucking goal. A lot of, I got a lot of big goals and you got to see, well, if I was to take on this task, if I was taking this goal, what would that mean? What would I have to sacrifice? So the first thing they got to go is this motherfucking bullshitting on the phone. That's pr talking to people and creating, uh, you know, bullshit relationships or maintaining relationships. That's not benefiting me. Listen, that's a dub.
That's a dub. I'm sorry. So what you'll find is people call themselves trying to be petty. Oh, I'm a, when I finally do reach back out to people, they ignore me. I'm like, oh, well, are those subs on, on Instagram or fucking Twitter? Be like, listen, I could do the same thing. And 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 then purposely ignore me as if I'm doing it purposely. And I'll tell these people I'm not doing it purposely, but they 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 don't they not they not they can't comprehend how I could do that and still ignore them. So, you know, people are gonna think what they want to think at the end of the day. Um, it's not bothering me because you're being you're calling yourself trying to be petty, trying to hurt me, or trying to do the same thing that you think I'm doing. But the only thing is, I'm gonna consistently behave in this manner because I'm trying to reach a goal. So. This year is not the year for me to necessarily jump in a relationship because that's not my priority. That's not something that I'm focused on. And obviously, the way that I'm moving, the way that I'm watching my step, I can't really afford to have a girlfriend. I can't really, that's not, that's not something because when you're in a relationship, that other person, your significant other, has obligations on you. You have to make time for them. That's not something I got time for. It's not. And not because I don't like an individual, not because I don't think they're special. And some people, oh, well, if you wanted them, if you like them, yeah, I can like you. But listen, I got other shit comes first. I'm fucking 26. I'm not trying to be one of these motherfuckers that's 30 years old and still living at home. Fuck out of here. That's not. No, I'm not doing that. Unless unless you got money, unless you're doing your thing, unless you have certain accomplishments. Because I know certain people that have that have money that are making millions that have great accomplishments. But they just, they're just very family oriented. I'm a Muslim. I know a lot of Muslims and with a lot of Muslim families that are like that. That's an exception. But if you, if you if your family not like that, you 30 years old, 30 something years old, still living at home with your mother, still in your mama basement, fuck out of here. No, I'm not doing that. I refuse. I am 26 years old. It's time to change things up. I'm not bullshit with nobody. I am crying.